All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel for another Fortnite video. Today I have some pretty interesting information and I want you guys to take this with a grain of salt and let me know how you feel about these particular weapons that could possibly be coming into the Fortnite Battle Royale. Now, specifically in this article, before I even bring you some gameplay, I'm just gonna read it off. They did state very, very clearly that they do not know, and this is not official, but this is basically due to data mining, which is basically when somebody gets all the data from like the recent patch and they go into the files and they start searching and digging and to find things under the same category as the battle royale of this game so like that's how they find these weapons in there sometimes you know the actual epic games could literally put these weapons there to deceive data miners and make them believe that these are actually coming when they're not but a lot of the times more often than none it actually means that eventually some way shape or form they will be coming into fortnite keep in mind that a lot of the times when these new weapons come out we're probably getting about one weapon a month in fortnite when they start getting to the x amount of weapons they start putting different weapons in the vault so i don't think it's going to be all of these weapons all at the same time in the game i think one once all these new weapons start running into the battle royale some of the weapons that are currently in the battle royale are going to be getting put into the actual vault therefore there's not so much like a you know a clusterfuck of like a bunch of weapons in the game so it says automatic shotguns precision rifles and more coming to fortnite battle royale further data mining of patch 3.1.0 has revealed a number of potential upcoming weapons for fortnite br from automatic shotguns to lmgs there's a huge variety in what's to come while none of this is official or confirmed the weapon were found in the same place as those currently present in the battle royale so it's likely we'll see at least some of the introduced in the future update again everything that's in this list most likely not all of them are going to be in the game but you can probably bet that a good portion of them eventually will one day come into battle royale and it could possibly be during this season three the reason i say that is because they were found after the patch so first off here you have the automatic shoddy it says shotgun automatic fires a widespread of pellets at an extreme rate of fire can decimate crowds at a significant ammo cost i guess if you play call of duty and you come from a call of duty background you can basically just think of some of the automatic shotguns we've had in call of duty think about the brecci maybe something slightly quicker than the brecci and maybe an automatic version but just imagine a shotgun with a widespread of pellets the break action shotgun here you have two rarities you got legendary and epic okay it is a break action deals high damage at a fast fire rate it has a short range and a very limited magazine size next up here we have hammer crush this is an assault rifle a slug gun a rifle that fires slugs with high damage and impact good accuracy but relatively slow rate of fire and high per bullet cost i want to say that definitely if the hammer crush were to come into the battle royale or when it comes into the battle royale they're probably going to put one of the new weapons not one of the new weapons i'm sorry one of the current assault rifles into the vault the reason i say that is because i believe that one of the most common types of weapons in this game are the assault rifles you have the scar you have the regular m4 or m16 whatever you guys consider it and then you have on top of that you have the burst rifle the burst assault rifle so i would want to say that most likely they would put some of the assault rifles into the vaults sorry dude give me one second here guys hey what's up take these minis there is more weapons coming by the way but just give me a second here and i'll get to them let me just start out my inventory. Pull this in here. Drink my little shield. Uh oh, somebody here. Oh god, there's somebody here. All right, crap, man, this shit is crazy. Oh my god, how am I still alive? Dear god. Teddy bear! There we go. Dude, this shit is fucking crazy! Alright, here we go. Relax. Just calm down. Pick up the pump shotgun. Should be A-OK. -okay. I'm gonna hide here. Every time I make an update video, I get the craziest lobbies. And when I want to get a good lobby, everything's dead as hell. So here we go. Wait a second. There we 
go. I'm running out of bullets here, man. Five kills already. That's insane. So as I was saying, I probably think if this were ever to be implemented, maybe the scar would be put into the vault and then be brought back, depending if people don't like this or whatever. Again, this is just speculation. I don't know which gun they would actually implement into the vault, but I would want to assume it's a slower shooting assault rifle. To be honest, right now, the scar is one of the slower shooting ones, but it's the most effective one. And this is also a legendary. So having two legendary assault rifles be kind of crazy. Now, light machine gun, assault rifle, assault weapon, I'm sorry, light machine gun, a heavy weapon with high damage. We all know what a, you know, light machine gun is. An extreme rate of fire and a huge magazine size, very inaccurate unless aiming down sights from a fixed position and firing in short burst. Legendary and epic would be the rarity for these weapons. Also, there's an M249 saw. Okay, I'm gonna hide right here. The M249 saw, an assault rifle, hydraulic, a slow firing high impact automatic rifle with a large magazine. These would be epic and rare. Now, this is more kind of like a minigun type of thing. I would assume if this were to get put into the game, again, the minigun would probably go into the vaults or something like that. I don't see them having just X amount of weapons, like a crazy amount of weapons in, in, in the game at the same time. It's just not a Fortnite-like thing to do, at least from what I've seen, you know, kind of like what they've been doing with this game and how they've been replacing weapons and putting different weapons aside and bringing new ones etc etc i think this season sometime in this season we're gonna get some weapons being put in the vault again we haven't seen it yet but we did see it last season and it's only a matter of time before they actually do that in this season as well now the last one would be a precision rifle as you guys can see here there are three rarities it is epic, rare, and uncommon. If you think about it, all these assault rifles that I'm mentioning here, it seems like a lot if you think about the ones that are currently in the game. But to keep the game fresh, they could put all the ones that are in the game, which are three types of assault rifles, the Burst, the M4, and the Scar, and replace all those three with these and see how it goes. And then that's how it would be. Now, the Precision Rifle is epic, rare, and uncommon. So it essentially would be kind of like an M4. It is an assault weapon, Burst, an assault rifle that fires, or maybe not, maybe it'll be like the Burst Rifle. An assault rifle that fires tight burst that allows for precision targeting and mobile mid-range engagements deals good damage but consumes its magazine very very quickly again it's three rarities kind of like the same burst rifle that we have currently in the game and i'm hiding inside the same fucking room and i'm dying to leave but damn i gotta leave now okay really quickly before we do anything i do feel like i gotta kind of come here get some materials oh no i'm being shot what the fuck he just sprinted I'm on top of the fucking door. No way, dude. No way I landed on top of the door. No fucking way, bro. Yeah, that's right, you little bitch. They call me T-Rex. I don't fuck around. Oh, God, dude. I don't even care if I die in this one. That was beyond amazing. That was literally fucking insane. Oh, my God. These weapons are not necessarily being introduced to the main game. They could be part of an upcoming limited time mode that were leaked recently. For detailed statistics about each weapon, yada, yada, damage, magazine size, you could check out the Storm Shield 1's BR database. Again, guys, not all of these weapons could be coming into the game. Most of them probably, some of them a handful, I really don't know. But just keep in mind that this game is not always going to stay the same. It's it's still in early access, the beta, whatever you guys want to call it. So they are going to be putting things in, taking them out, weapons, gear, consumables, whatever it is. And that's just the way it is. That's the way that they're going about this game. And it's not a bad thing. Trust me, if, if, if some of you guys disagree with some of the weapons they implement in the game, they will put them back. They'll put them in the vault and bring the ones you guys like they just want to test out different weapons and see how they work with the with the fan base with the players at the end of the day epic games has yet to literally disappoint us all the weapons they brought into the game feel natural they feel not too overpowered not too weak they feel good you know, they feel pretty well balanced. If you were to ask me, I feel like they feel balanced enough to the point where I, I'm really not disappointed. So I guess at the end of the day, at the end of it all, if you were to ask me, am I kind of upset with this decision? No, I, I want them. I really want them to bring new weapons into the game. Like I think bringing new weapons would give the game a little bit of flavor, would make the game stay fresh. One of the main reasons why this game is, is so successful is because it's always fresh. There's always new things coming in. So if they have the formula down packed, why not keep, you know, producing the the same formula and that formula is producing new content every single week literally and just keep you know going with the flow and i am down to top 10 on an update video that i don't know how i stayed alive back there with that trap i jumped on top of the fucking door i guess t-rex t-rex out here proving them haters wrong man oh there's somebody over there that was super dope man that was super super dope that is probably the luckiest shit i've ever done <laughs> since i've been playing fortnite but anyways what do you guys think of these weapons which out of these weapons do you think should not come into fortnite and which out of these weapons would you like to come to fortnite let me know in the comment section boys is that a blue ar
Have you ever died to like a really shitty player? Like a player that, that you know you're better than, right? Have you, has that ever happened to you? Well, it just happened.